am a big believer in really thoughtful strategies to help us get to have a clear roadmap to get where we want to go faster. So I also believe that every teacher in America as part of regular teacher training should be able to recognize the symptoms of toxic stress. I'm sick and tired of hearing about children as, as early as preschool being booted out of school for expressing symptoms of a neurodevelopmental challenge, right? It's unjust. And it shouldn't be happening. And exactly what Aunt Anna said in terms of, the, we're not blame, this is not about blaming teachers. If I had a, if you had a teacher trying to teach a class of 30 kids and 15 of them had epilepsy, you're not gonna blame the teacher when the test scores come in low. You need to understand that toxic stress is about inhibition of the executive function in the, in the prefrontal cortex. That's biologically what happens. And so when we have organizations like, you know, Turnaround for Children right here in New York that builds infrastructure and protocols within the teaching and learning environment to help to reduce the impact of adversity, then what we see is that kids are able to learn and thrive.